We didn't record any of that. I've just said what a fantastic church it is. I've got to go back now. So I thought I was recording and I wasn't. That happened so many times, you know. There would have been a big hall somewhere as well. Um, there would have been a big hall. I've just got to go back to this bit. So I didn't record any of that. Something round the back there. We'll look at that later. We'll look at that church. Look at that church. Isn't it fantastic? Lots of rules, no ball games. Very quiet here, isn't it? I like how they've done this, the little windows as well. It's amazing. I mean, just look at that. It looks like it's sat on the roof of that building, isn't it? I don't know if I've been recording anything, actually. I keep forgetting to check the button. There's another really good view of it, look. This, this was my diversion today, by the way. This is my diversion. Over and out again. Yeah, I mean, what would have been sort of in different buildings as well, um, there would have been other residences. I've just got a snippet of it, really. I'll have to go online and uh... <sighs> Yeah, this would have all been belonging to Garancho. This would have all been belonging to the, the hospital, you see. Wouldn't it? It's a shame it's not open to the public anymore, isn't it? Lovely church like that. And then through there, you've got the the bell tower right through there. That so let's take another picture. Just one more little video before I go. It's very unlikely I'll ever come back. I might do. You never know. Yeah, I've got to do, I'll go online later, then I can pair up the, the map of it. I can pair up the map. Yeah, this has all been wards. All round here. Yeah, I don't know if they would have had the... Maybe they did have the small windows then. Maybe they did. Oh, 
Yeah, there's the bell tower there. Uh, the water tower. I don't know what that is. And then up there. Back down that way. Might be a dead end again. East Corp. I could find myself in a dead end, couldn't I? They haven't got any labels. Because look at that. Look at those arches there. That would have been of some significance, wouldn't it? You know? I expect they get a lot of people around doing this. I don't know that band. What that would have been? Water tower? Could it have been a water tower? Could have been, couldn't it? It's interesting though, isn't it? It's really well maintained. Well, it's amazing. All right, over and out a minute. Right then, there's the spire again. Look at those lovely trees. It's so clean and well maintained, this place. That's like one big hall, I would have thought, that building there with that tower on the top. it called this bit private property <laughs> right so this is um mendip's old mental hospital very what very nice as well i must say small panes of glass they started putting small panes in because of people putting their fists through them all the time it's regular. This is probably all flats. This bit of grand, this grand building here. And there's a lovely tree there, look. A pancake. A canopy type tree there, see? I've gone right round to the main part. Obviously there were farms and all sorts attached to these um, attached to these in the past. Gilbert Scott House. Gilbert Scott House. Let's just zoom in on that. To remind me. Gilbert Scott. And I can look it all up. Yeah, it's a grand place actually, isn't it? And then you've got all the different buildings either side, all very geometrically placed as well. But it's lovely, isn't it? Lovely oriental type sculpturing of the top bits. They all got special names, of course. Lovely, isn't it? You take a bit right then. That's my brief visit to the old Mendip Mental Hospital. All done up rather nice. Really nicely. Really, really done up. Amazing. I wonder if they're going to play cricket today. Oh. Somebody coming.
well it's probably about 30 years since I was here. <coughs> it's changed quite a bit. It's not changed but it has. 30 years ago. That was only a brief visit when I worked as a cadet nurse for 18 months at Moorhaven and then I got I became a student nurse but by the time I'd done the cadetship and I'd seen how things were doing with mental health I actually um, changed my mind and um, I didn't, I didn't want to be a mental nurse in the end, so I didn't like how they treated the people, you know. But 30 years ago, yeah, there's a lot of changes, 40 years even. Ah, the landscape's the same. Right, over and out for now. It's about midday. I've done really well actually. That early start made all the difference. Getting the early bus. Now this was a spontaneous thing. I never even thought of this when I got on the bus this morning. Or even any other time. I only fleetingly thought I'd ever get out there. But uh, plan A was the cathedral but I thought I just roamed off for a little while and uh, I I don't know, curiosity took me along a track and I found the old Mendip Mental Hospital which like all the old hospitals were bought up, sold off and made private but with a skeleton outline of of what was once um, a mental hospital lots of new buildings, obviously land, all this would have been land this would have had a... this. Just down here, you can tell how it's sculptured. That would have been of, of importance, this bit here. Uh, would have been probably all mowed grass. Um, somewhere to walk. There could even be little features. Um, yeah. Beautiful, beautiful setting. They often were in such beautiful settings. Um, there, there was a lot you could say was useful, really. Um, I'm going to go on that path in a minute. Just want to quickly see if there is anything down here a minute. Oh. Might get another view of the hospital from a distance as well. I'm not quite sure where this takes us. It's a path to somewhere though, isn't it? Let's just go and have a quick look. I think my shoes need tightening up again. Just see if we can get another view from back here. Oh yeah, you can, look. That's quite, I'm glad I did just zoom off for a minute just to get this view. Let me take some pictures. <laughs> <laughs> 